Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. And it is time that we are playing the number one seed in the playoffs here. We are the New York Knicks, and we're going against the number one seed, Atlanta Hawks. And I don't know how I feel about this. Gafford is out day to day. And we take the early lead up seven nine to nothing eleven to nothing thirteen to three. We take a great lead in the first quarter. We come out firing, absolutely on fire. But the Hawks come back in a huge way, in an absolutely massive way against us right now. Absolutely just destroying us. Oh my gosh! Are they that good? Buddy Heal, who do they have? Buddy Heal, Cunningham, Gordon. They got don't they have nobody, dude. So they got Diamond Mitchell out for the season right now. Buddy Heal is day to day, and Highland is out for the season. I don't like that. That just happened. I'm not a fan of that at all. Okay, here we go again. We are in Atlanta. If we can get a win in Atlanta, if we can take come away with a win in Atlanta, I would be very excited about that. Where the the way that the Hawks have been playing, they've been playing very well. Okay. We're in the fourth quarter. We are up by Six, five minutes to go, up by six, holding our lead steady. They are getting made, very close to us. I don't like that they are as close as they are. We win 106 to 105 in Atlanta. Oh. Bridges gets this done tonight against the Hawks. Touch and go for a while, but we closed the deal. Porter Jr. is back from his injury, fully healed. They don't have, like, any of their body heals in there. That's it, you guys. Wow. Okay. We're going to go on again here. Adjust the rotation manually. We're good. Okay. Game three, we are in New York. We're coming home. And they're taking a big lead on us. They got a lead on us already here in New York at home. We don't like seeing that. We're down by 15 points at least. 17 points going into the fourth. But we're kind of coming back a little bit. We would like to. We're down by 10, down by 8. Ah, we're not going to win this one. No, we're not. We're not going to get the win here. Okay. Two to one. We need to get this win here. We're at home. We need to get a big time win against the Hawks to tie up the series to make it two and two. And it looks like we're on our way to doing that, which we do. Holy mackerel. Okay. We have tied up. Oops, I don't want to do that. We've tied up the series. And they're tied up as well. The Lakers and the Mavericks are tied up as well. So now we're going to go for game five back to Atlanta. And... This game is going to be crazy as well. I can already tell. But we need to get a win here because we're going to go back. I believe game six, we're going back to back home for weeks. Game six. We're up by one. They're up by one. <gasps> we need to score. Score again. Let's go. Let's go. Woo. Let's go. You guys. Holy mackerel. Okay. Wow. 
Oh, ho, ho, ho. The Lakers take the lead on their side as well, and we are playing Atlanta at home for game six. We could close it out here. If Atlanta wins, if Atlanta wins, they go back to Atlanta for game seven. I don't like this, our chances at all right now. We are getting crushed. Can we get closer, though? Can we make this game... Can we make this game a closer game? I don't think we're going to be able to come back from that. No, we're not. Oh, my gosh. We're going to game seven, folks. And these guys are going at it right now, too. This is game six for them, I believe, too. Lakers have won it. The Lakers are advancing to the NBA championship. Of course they are. Why wouldn't they? Okay. We got game six. Game seven, I mean. Here it is. This is game seven. How close can we get? Can we keep it a close game? Can we make this game come down to the wire? Because they have been holding a steady lead on us the entire game. They're up by 12. We got to come back. You got to come back. Got to come back. Slowly, lose, slowly making our, us look like we just lost it, you guys. We just lost it. Jimmy Butler. At least we lost to the team that beat us, right? But on to bigger and better things. In the next episode, we get to do the offseason. Which means we get to sign some players. We also get a draft. And we got some picks coming up in this draft. So I'm excited to see how that works out. Alright, everybody. Thank you for watching. I'll see you again real soon.